Uh, thank you, Mr. President. I, I wanted to challenge you on, on one of the statements that you made in the tail end of the campaign uh, in, in the midterms. That here, this, here we go. That, well, if Let's you don't go. mind, Let's Mr. President, that this caravan was an invasion. As you know, I, Mr. President, I consider it to be an invasion. As you know, Mr. President, the caravan was not an invasion. It's a, it's a, a group of migrants moving up from Central America towards the border with the U.S. Thank you for telling and me And uh, why, why, why did you characterize it as such? Uh, and because I consider it an invasion. You and I have a difference of opinion. But do you think that you demonized immigrants in not this election no, to try I to keep... Them, I want them to come into the country, but they have to come in legally. You know, they have to come in, Jim, through a process. I want it to be a process. And I want people to come in, and we need the people. Your you know, campaign... Wait, your campaign... Wait, wait. You know why we need the people, don't you? Because we have hundreds of companies moving in. We need the people. Right. But your campaign had an ad showing migrants climbing over walls and well, so on. Well, that's true. It pour, it, but they it, weren't actors. They're not going to be doing they that. They weren't actors. Well, no, it's true. Do you think they were actors? They weren't actors. They didn't come from Hollywood. Right. These, were, these were people. This was an actual, you know, it happened a few days ago. And, uh, They're hundreds of miles away, though. They're hundreds and hundreds of miles you know away. That, that's I not an invasion. Should, honestly, uh, I think you should let me run the country. You run CNN. All right. And if you did it well, your ratings well, let me would be ask, much if better. I, if I may okay, ask one enough. other question, Mr. President, if I, if I may ask Peter, one other question, ahead. are you worried? Of, that's enough. That's no, enough. Mr. President, I, well, that's I was enough. going to ask one of the, the other folks. That's had, enough. Pardon me, ma'am. I'm, I'm, Mr. Excuse President, me. That's enough. Mr. President, I had one other question, if I may ask, on the Russia investigation. Are you concerned that... That you may have I'm not concerned about anything with you the Russian investigation because it's a hoax. Are you, That's enough. Put down the mic. Mr. President, are you worried about indictments coming down in this investigation? Mr. President. I'll tell you what, CNN should be ashamed of itself having you working for them. You are a rude, terrible person. You shouldn't be working for CNN. Go ahead. I, I think that's unfair. You're a very rude person. The way you treat Sarah Huckabee is horrible. And the way you treat other people are horrible. You shouldn't treat people that way. Go ahead. In, in, go ahead, Jim, Peter. Go in, ahead. In Jim's defense, I've traveled with him and watched him. He's a diligent reporter who busts. Well, I'm not a big fan of yours either. So I you understand. Know, to be honest. So let, me, so let me ask you a question, if I can. You repeatedly you said are, you are the best, Mr. President. You repeatedly over the course. Okay, of the, just sit down, please. Well, when you when you report fake news, no. When you report fake news, which CNN does a lot, you are the enemy of the people. Go ahead. Mr. President, over the, course, over the course of the last several days of the campaign, sir, sir, at the end of the campaign, you repeatedly said that Americans need to fear Democrats. You said Democrats would unleash a wave of violent crime that endangers families everywhere. Why are you because pitting very Americans, weak on crime. Why are you pitting Americans Peter, against one another, sir? Peter, what are you trying to be him? No, Peter, I'm just let, asking me just, question. let me just tell you. Very simple because they're very weak on crime, because they have often suggested members and people within the Democrat Party at a high level have suggested getting rid of ICE, getting rid of law enforcement. That's not going to happen, okay? We want to be strong on the borders. We want to be strong on law enforcement. And I want to, I want to cherish ICE, because ICE does a fantastic job.